All right, guys, welcome to my bathroom. I promised you guys a while ago that I was going to um, do a video comparing the Paul Mitchell 1.25 Hot Tool Straightening Iron to my Remington Wet to Straight, which is my old gun. I think this guy was 25 bucks. As for a straightener that's just on the market, I would actually say this is one of the better ones that you can get cheap. Um, there's a really funny picture of me and a bunch of my friends like chilling out because we were all at my house. I can get us some glass. And uh, everyone was using my straightener. They're like, this is a really good straightener. And I was like, oh my gosh, yeah, I'm not good. Like, it's not dry hair. So, um, that's really funny to me now because that is so outdated and wrong. Um, this guy is really cool, but he, I have to admit, he has nothing on this guy. So here's what's going on right now. I promised that I was going to um, talk about these a while ago, but it just so happens that right now, um, Paul Mitchell is running this big contest with its future professionals, and um, we are selling them, which is really great for you guys. If you guys are interested, um, I'm going to compare them and talk about the benefits of them, and like, in my honest opinion, it is so worth it now that I'm a hairdresser, and like, I kind of get to see um, the actual effect of using good product and using really, really good tools, like vital, if you're really serious about the integrity of your hair. Um, I know you live it in London Cause you keep on complaining Where is the sun shining? Always is raining That's all I'm hearing Skies ain't clearing Your eyes keep on tearing You're missing New York So, um, I'm really trying to hustle Do you miss me? Do you miss our talks? Do you miss our searching? And our midnight walks Do you miss the ocean? Do you miss you or anyone you know? Do you miss me all? Miss you, man. And I have to laugh like crazy. I really think you're crazy. You might as well ask. Is it hot day hazy? Is your left eye maybe? Have I ever laid What it does do is it heats up pretty high. You have to 200. I don't know. Show you guys first off. I don't have to like properly straighten your hair this. I have a secret. I have really secretly bad hair. Um. It was really color treated, so I just cut all of it off. But I have all of these little kinky guys down here um, that really kind of need help. But I kind of mask it with my top hair and um, put a lot of effort into it with my styling to kind of hide that. When you're using pr um, a straightener, you're going to want to use some products. Um, what's cool is that with this deal for Caper, the iron's usually 180 and we're selling it for 170 and we're also giving you hot off the press and fast form. The fast form is way bigger than this, I promise. This one is just like my little version. So I'm also going to kind of review these products for you and I am really love them. Um, but anytime that you're going to be flat ironing your hair, you need to put some protection on it. I really like this hot off the press because it's also like a hairspray. It has like an invisible hold. Because you just kind of like apply it to your hair and you know, you don't need to be um, too generous with it or anything. But I would like to get like good saturation with it just so you make sure that your hair is going to be protected. And it forms like this little shield um, between your hair and between the iron. I'm going to start off using my Remington's. Um, it's up pretty high. I think it's like almost at its highest. Um, and we're just going to kind of examine the performance that this one gives. So I'm going to take a little strand of hair now. And you see it's kind of like, I'm going to get up in your belt, it's kind of limp. Not much to it. Um, and whenever you straighten your hair, I recommend that you do this thing called the truck and trailer method. So what you do is you comb it out, and you kind of stick your comb in there. And then you kind of follow it. One thing that I don't like about this is see how it's kind of jumping. It jumps um, while you're straight. Um, so you don't get a very smooth transition. Um, but other than that, it does get your hair straight, but this hair, like, it does not feel too so happy afterwards. Um, this is just, I don't know if this is ceramic or just metal, but like, it really just kind of abuses your hair. It gets it straight, it does the job right, but it doesn't do anything for the integrity of your hair. In fact, it's kind of taking it away from that. And that's not what you like to do to your hair. Who likes to do that to their hair? Not me. Um, so I just did one strand. I'll do another with this one, and then we'll switch out irons. Um, 
I'm kind of doing this the wrong way. I'm aware I should be looking at your favorite costume than me. But I'm just kind of trying to show it. Um, Yeah. See that? Leaves like a bigger line of demarcation. Um, this is just kind of like the dent in your hair. Um, and they're harder to avoid with this. And like it has um on its sides, they're very pointed. So you can't really curl your hair with this, which is one of the really cool aspects of this one. Um, when you use this, you're using it strictly for straightening purposes. And if you try and curl it, your hair's gonna get caught. It's gonna like look really like this big kinked out thing that looks like this too, pretty much. And I'm not, you know, originally I was like, oh my gosh, it, it heats up so high. I just love everything that it does for my hair. And now I'm just kind of like, no, thank you. Now let's talk about this guy. Okay. Now he's a professional styling product, and I am obsessed. I had always heard about um, good styling products, and I'd seen that hairdressers use them, and I just always assumed that like they just mean to do my hair better. Um, but what I found was that this is a really manageable, easy one. It heats up to 400 degrees, and it has some really cool aspects to it, like this at the bottom. Woo! It has a swivel bottom. So while if I want to curl my hair with it and I swivel, my cord's not going to get all jacked up. And I love that about it. That's really, really important to me. So um, I'm heating it up right now. It really doesn't take very long to heat up at all. But um, an important thing to know about this is that it is suitable for all hair types, which means um. There's girls with really fine hair like me, like if you look at this, I don't really have much in there. I have a large density of hair, but I don't have very thick fabric of hair. So, um, when you have girls who have fine hair like me, we probably have four layers of cuticle. You can have as little as four. And that means that there are four little layers of little, like, scales hanging out on top of the inside of your hair. And then it's gone. So that's terrifying, first off. If you have fine hair, you really need to invest in getting a good straightener. Because if you get one of these, everyone just thinks like, oh yeah, the hotter the better. And just burn it off. But that's completely not true. What you need to do is you need to invest in a straightener that has like ions built into it and is smooth enough that it will really just get through there and go all the way down to your end and not burn off your hair. And keeping the integrity of your hair when you have fine hair is really important. I know that for a fact. Um, if you have more coarse hair, then you're gonna want one that has a higher temperature to it. That's obvious because when you have a higher temperature, it um, will smooth out your curly hair. Um, and if you have coarse hair, you probably have 18 layers of cuticle. Now, that's awesome because that means that your hair is gonna be really thick always, you're gonna have a lot of it, but it also um, takes a little bit more to penetrate into that to um, really pull it down straight and to, you know, not just damage it like this guy probably does. So when we talk about that, um, I could and probably should use it only on like 280 degrees, which is still hotter than this thing gets. Um, I could even drop it down to like 240 if I wanted to and still get good results. Um, a lot of girls like instantly are just like, oh yeah, let's do it, let's do it. Let's do it. Um, and that's not necessarily true. I am going to crank it up pretty hot because I want you guys to see like the type of results that this can um, give you. And we just kind of straightened my top a little bit. So I'm going to pull it back now. You can see how dead my hair is. And I'm going to clip it. Don't make fun of my curly clip. Um, so yeah, look at all that dead hair. Oh my gosh, I did this myself a while ago. Um, so it doesn't look very cute. And no matter what I do to it, it still like has like a curl, it's really fluffy. Um, so we, I'm gonna make sure that there's some more hot off the press up in that bad boy. And I'm gonna take my, this is one of my cutting combs from Paul Mitchell, actually. But we're gonna take it, hold it in there, and then take this guy out. Now what you're supposed to do when you're counting, when you're um, flattering your hair, is you're supposed to count to seven. So um, 
you go through and like it, that just is a basic rule for how slow you want to go with it um because you really like want to get it right the first time so you just count like one two three four five six seven okay now our Paul Mitchell irons have a two swipe guarantee um if you go through it more than twice and um, you're not getting the type of straight that you want. Either it's not on the right temperature for you, you are not doing it right, or there is something wrong with your iron, and, and you can come back and totally either replace it or exchange it, give it back. We have that guarantee on all of our tools. Um, so, as you can see, that is pretty dang straight now. Um, what I like about it is that it doesn't really create um, much static to it, like a lot of the other tools that I've used in the past have done that. Um, so this one is laced with irons in it, so it kind of calms that a bit. Now if I wanted to get an even more sleek look with this, I'm using the wide teeth of my comb right now. Um, I would want to use the finer teeth, and that creates more tension. So it allows me to kind of like pull on two things at once. Yeah. Look at that. And like, it, um, the, what the ions do is it also like creates like a real shine in it. And I know that that hair is completely dead. Like, it's gone. It, like, RIP. It's been bleached so many times. So, good night, sweet prince. Um, let's try and attack some of these little guys I have under here. I just have this weird wave pattern. It just curly cues there every time. So, I'm gonna take it in a smaller section. Now, I'm not even going to use truck and trailer this time. I'm just going to use it in my fingers for maximum tension. Just kind of pull it in. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Almost completely gone. And these are like really, really stubborn little hairs up there, too. And where'd they go? They're gone. So, intense. I really, really like this iron. So I'm gonna go ahead and straighten out the rest of this quickly. I have it cranked up way too hot for my hair right now. I'm not gonna lie. My hair is just like, oh, what are you doing to me? <laughs> I have a problem when I do my hair. I have a cowlick. There is where the other product that comes in this bag comes in. Fast form, fast form is incredible. Um, it's a cream and it's got like a lot of like jojoba and um, avocado oil in it. So, um. It has like all these really natural things that provide for a really great, like really resistant hold. But it's not a heavy hold. It just kind of like gives your hair like a little something something um, and helps your style stick together. So what I'm doing is I put a little bit in my hand and I'm warming it up. So now what you do is you take your like four fingers and you kind of like rake it through your hair. I would rake it through your ends first. And then like as you're coming up to the top, kind of like get into your palm and into the pads. What this product does is it reduces your static like a lot. So if you have really frizzy hair, this is probably your guy. And um, it makes your hair look a lot piecier. So like if I wanted to like kind of like punk it out a little bit more, I totally could. Um, the tube that they give you of it is like this size. And I think that one's like $18 in the store. Um, what um, I think is so cool is that it comes in this for free. Um, this package, it comes completely free with it, um, and you get $10 off the straightener, you get this hot off the press spray, and you get the bigger two, I swear, of the fast form. I think I have a picture of it, like right here. Um, if you guys want to have really hot straight hair, please contact me so that I can sell these. I'm trying to hustle them as quickly as possible. But yeah, that's, I think, the benefits of this. I honestly haven't run into anything wrong with it yet. I'll probably make more videos later on showing how to curl your hair with this. Because as you can see, like, the edges of it are kind of curved. So that's made so that you can make bigger barrel curls with it. If you guys want to know anything else, leave me a comment, talk to me later, and I'll talk to you soon.